Hey everyone, this is DK3 Knight, and we are going to play The Longest Journey. Joining me today is... Jackie, and... <laughs> Slash and, Aerith, uh, and whatever we want to call him today. So, yes. we're, what we're doing is we're taking turns collaborating on an, an adventure game. Now... Yes, last week... Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, sh I was no, go, actually go, go, going go, to... Go ahead, go ahead, explain, explain, it's cool. Actually, last week we did... Uh, Catherine Rain or oh, Katie Rain, right? Yeah, Kathy, Katie Rain. Kath, no, Kathy's Katie Rain. Rain. <laughs> Kathy's Rain. <laughs> I, sorry. Catherine, Everybody's yes. Uh, no, no, not Catherine. <laughs> no, not Catherine. Different game. <laughs> a different uh, game. It's called. It's a new game called Katie's Rain. Um, and that's a cool game, a cool adventure game, which was recently released in 2016, and which took the style from the 2000, early 2000s to the early 1990s adventure point-and-click games. So yeah, uh, as we promised with, uh, I promised with Chris. He will be collaborating with me with my adventure game. I'll be collaborating with him with the longest journey, his adventure game, which he picked. Yes, but the thing weekend. is, he's actually good at adventure games. So, like, I actually <coughs> need him a lot more than he needs me. Like, when when I was doing when we, when he was doing Kathy Rain, I was like, I don't really feel like I know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm doing a terrible job. <laughs> No, it's fine. The problem was we were live streaming because Katy's rain was. The problem was I didn't have fraps, to yes. be honest, and that was some other issues. Yes. Since Skype didn't want to. S ah, since I also I didn't have another monitor for Skype to see. Yes. What yes. Um, but I'm actually. I, I'm actually cheating here because I'm sharing my screen through Skype, so he gets a, a view of what we're actually doing. That's not too delayed. Um, so <laughs> let's start. Uh, this game came back. This game came out back in 2002, but it looks like there's some other information here which scares me. Um, I have this one and the dream one as well, but I believe this one came out first, so we're gonna start with the first one. So let's begin the journey now that we've talked on for like three minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Prologue. A lion is in the streets. So, Take some you've come to hear me tell a story, have you? If you oh please, we would love to hear one of your stories. You have seen so much. You have lived so long. <laughs> oh, so good of you to remind me of my age, child. No, don't worry. I am an old woman, but I've lived a long and fulfilling life, and I do have stories to tell. Which story would you like to hear? A true one. A true story. Who asked for a true story? Oh, my stories are true, child. There are enough fairy tales in the world already. There's no I don't want to be to rude, but more, this looks me. so weird, the drawings. <laughs> Tell us the story of the balance, then. It looks like a person with a... Is a type shape with his sister who balance? looks out of. Oh, that's a long story, child. What and is this? It's like I a globe or something. This hour. But perhaps I could tell you a story that I heard a long time ago. Yes, Grandma, tell us a story that you a heard a long that time ago. A crucial turning point I wish I could hear the audio, balance. but I'm having difficulties hearing the audio that since Skype decided day, that you can You can read the subtitles then. Please, yes, that does sound like a story we'd like to hear. Very well. I actually enter in sub. When it comes to subtitles, I enter. Like all if you notice. good stories begins it's where it decisions. ends. In a tower. <laughs> like with subtitles, click. No more. Click. No, it's because it's like a pop-in to me. Oh.
Okay. Okay, it started. Yay. But did you skip the cutscene? No, right? No. Oh, no. Don't tell me I'm dreaming again. You know, for once, just once, it would be nice to have a decent night's sleep without waking up screaming from a bad dream at 4 a.m. Postcard pretty. Let's save the game. Okay. You 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 guys have an interesting save uh, unlike Catty Rain. Well, I'm having this little build thing flash in front of me. Like my game is trying not to like be full screen and it's can Oh you... yeah, I can see it as well. Yeah, and I really hope that's not something that comes through. This good. Inception. Real life never looked this good. Obviously, real life doesn't look like this. It's a dream world. Like real life never looked this good. Oh, I got rid of the stupid flashing. Apparently, I had to press like a key on my keyboard. Oh yeah, that's, the flash went away. Lucky. Okay, so if I press D on my keyboard, it comes back. Okay, um, there we go. I figured out how to move to the right. <sighs> Let's see what's it doing. What's happening? So remind me, um, Aerith, that pressing D does terrible things, and not to press that oh, button. Oh, perfect. Okay, press D. I guess if I don't do something to save that egg, I'll suffer seven years of bad karma or something. Oh no. Yes, yeah, so that's oh, terrible. No. It's a big bird. So what shall I do? Look at it? It looks reptilian, but it can't be. It's much, much too big and... and... I think you had to pick it up. I don't much care for reptiles. Okay, we'll pick it up. No, to be honest, can she actually pick it up? Did that sound come from the egg? Boy, that's some chick! I told her to pick it up. I don't think I can get a good grip on it. It's too big and slippery, I and I might drop it by that. accident. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, I think I might need a tool or something. Yeah. By the way, this is a true clicking a click clicking the clicking point adventure game. It's a nest, padded with large scales, very large scales. For some strange reason, I have a feeling I should get the hell out of here before the. That was a DOS return. game, which this reminds me of an old DOS game. I can't remember exactly what's the name of that old DOS game. This is uh, interesting. But it was a cool I've game, never seen nevertheless. Never scale this size before. Okay, I told her to pick up the scale. I'll keep so it can we use the scale? I, I let's see. Um, no, I don't think so. Oh, okay. So. I'm an Old artist, tree. not a botanist, but I'm pretty certain this tree is dead. We're close to it. I'm an artist, not a botanist, but I'm pretty certain this tree is dead. We're close to it. No, I might drop it. There's got to be some other way to get it back. And lucky thing the egg got caught between those roots. It's a long way Can't down. click the roots. I did. It just, it, there's only an observation for the root. Oh, that's oh, such okay. a beautiful landscape. Makes sense. Real life never looked this good. I should probably stop clicking how awesome the landscape is. We all know it's awesome. My goodness, it's actually very... Try going right. Something happened to this rock quite recently, and it probably altered the course of the stream. Oh, the stick. Hey, maybe that's why the tree's dying. Get the stick, get the stick, get the what stick. What stick? What stick? This one? Yeah, twigs. I will take okay, the twig. I saw it like a stick, oh. so... Oh, oh look Try what you did. Oh, the suffering we must endure. Okay, what? now uh, Why do you take such pleasure in torturing us? Torturing you? Who are you? We are the voice of all trees, the spirit of wood and leaf. You're a talking... 
tree? No, a tree does not talk. At least not in your tongue. The tongue of trees is the language of wood, root, and leaf. Who are you then? Like we said, we are the voice of all trees. Whenever an injustice is done, we must speak for the tree if we are present. It's the branch. I shouldn't have broken the branch off. Oh, what does it matter anyway? There is nothing more to be done for us. We are simply here to provide comfort in the final passing to Earth. We? I only see one of you. We are one with our host, as we are all one spirit, but Legion. Yeah, uh, thanks for clearing that up. <sighs> we do not expect you to understand. You are human. And you're in your underwear. <laughs> okay, choice time. What do you want me to say? Mm. What's the deal? What's the deal with the egg? What's the deal with the egg? No. Egg? What egg? Oh, of course, the child. Whenever the mother was absent, we were entrusted with the safety of the child. But now, withered and without strength, we can do nothing to help. We have failed the mother, and we despair. Our shame knows no bounds. Okay, do you want to ask another question? What happened to the tree? What happened to the tree? Oh, the pain. As the battle raged, we... Battle? Between the mother and black chaos. She was only protecting her child, but it would not back down. And the force of their battle shook the mountain. The brook that fed us was led astray, and without water, we began to wither and die. Who are you again? We are the wood spirit. We come to all trees in the that. hour of great need to provide comfort and aid in the passing to earth, and to give a voice to those who suffer. Our time is running out as we speak. The passing to earth is about to begin. Leave us now. What about the egg? Oh, it is too late. Without sustenance, we do not have the strength to bring it safely home. We have failed. And the earth will know our shame for all time to come. Is there anything? Huh? Oh, is there anything? Isn't there anything I can do to help? Oh, we do not expect a human to come to our aid. Lose the attitude, okay? Just tell me if there's anything I can do. <laughs> it is futile. We need water, but there is none. Not after the brook changed course. I'll find a way. Don't panic. We do not panic. Unlike you, we accept our destiny. If, however, against all odds, you do succeed, we will carry the child safely back into its nest. Do not make a foolish attempt on your own. It would spell certain misery. Okay, so we have to direct the stream. Okay. Fresh mountain water. Back in the real world, they'd probably charge 15 bucks a bottle for this. <laughs> According to the, um, spirit, there was some kind of battle that split the rock and changed the course of the stream. We could use the branch, but what would it do? I figured this one out all on my own. Oh, lucky. Um, How do you do that? This should do the trick. 
Check this out. Look how good I, I am. Spirit, because that looks scary. Yes. Well, see, what I did is I put the branch into the ground, and then put the scale, and, and I <laughs> laid the scale on top of the the V beam of the branch, and so essentially, the branch the became a support is, beam. To be logically speaking, does it work? Will it work? It, it makes sense logically. actually, because okay. The no, for scale, a short term, it would. What now? Like because this, the branch is not strong enough to hold a pressure like that. Well, no, I put it into the ground, and so still the scale, the scale. Well, it, well, the thing is, the scale is leaning on the rock, right? So the rock is really holding it up. Um, the branch is just like holding the bottom end up. Okay, makes kind of a little sense, but I wish we can do an experiment in real life to see if it really works. <laughs> But never mind. I'm I don't a bit know. skeptical. I, I don't. Well, uh, there. Look at that. See how that works? Wow, cool. So like, just the butt end of the scale is like right here, and the other part of the scale is on the rock. So essentially, so, I I made an elaborate uh, support pillar, sort of. <laughs> sort of, yeah. <laughs> so let's talk to the tree master or to Voldemort. Let us talk to the old tree. Hello, hello. Are you alive? Leave us be. Are you okay? We find our strength returned, and so we have no time for idle conversation. We must drink and rejoice. Aren't we forgetting something? Hush, listen. The song of ancient wood. Is it not sweet? Sweet, definitely. Yeah, the baby's probably ready to boogie down as well. The baby. Oh, the egg. Thank the earth. We almost forgot. It's just in front of you. How could you forget it? it you is. were uh -oh. tasked to protecting them. Oh my goodness. Oh god, no. You gotta be no, kidding me. No, no, no. no. Oh. He got it. He was lifting oh, okay, it. You doubted the tree. The tree? No, the egg was just in front of them. <laughs> and they are holding it. How come he didn't realize that? Well, he forgot about it. He was doing what? other things. What was that? Yeah, like drinking water. It's like, ah. Oh. Uh oh. Like I, like well, I think if you were dying, incidentally, you were not dying, you'd be pretty happy. Uh oh. What is this weird bone? It is you. You have come. come. You know me. April, daughter, I have been waiting for you. What? Not waiting? Why? What is this game? It here with you, as it always has. What do you mean? The breach and the mending, the pain and the joy, the end of the old and the dawn of the new. A different world. I am the mother of what is, but you, you are the mother of a future that may yet be. How will I know? How will I know what to do? I will guide you, and I will protect you as much as I can. But in the end, you are on your own. I'm afraid. You always Don't were, me. my child, my daughter. This is getting creepy. Well, this is a, this is like an Alice this in Wonderland is moment. Probably not a good thing. It is, yeah. <laughs> this is probably not a good thing. <laughs>
in Penumbra. Pen Never mind. I'm not gonna be attempt trying to pronounce okay. that. Okay. That the dream sequence is done. Exhausted. Oh fun. Must have been tossing took some time. I really wish they make so episodic games like this do. because it's no fun and at the same time uh, I wish they, they make games like this like in my own sweat every night this past week to be honest that's right it doesn't I, look I, like it's gonna cool down anytime soon either it's another sunny day in Newport I'm gonna mess with you and play sin uh, sin episode one one of these days just to mess with you well it's a good oh, thing the studio's sure. got proper air conditioning I promised myself I was going to spend most of the day working, and I don't intend to break that promise. Not this time. <sighs> the wardrobe is actually made of real wood, and not that synthetic crap that makes me sneeze and itch all over. Okay, that's my desk. so... So, theoretically, that's where I'm supposed to do my work. I think my muse has departed me for greener pastures, though, because lately, inspiration's been fleeting at best. Interesting. Let's speak to our diary, because that Can just you seems do like... that? Dear yes. diary, note to self. Dreams of talking trees and dragons aside, it's still no excuse for talking to inanimate matter in the real world. <laughs> <laughs> quit it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's that's really hilarious. See, I, I could touch it, I could talk to it, or I can look at it. <laughs> no, that's just too weird. <laughs> I don't know, this reminds this character reminds me of the similar personality of uh, Katie Rains or Katerine. Okay, apparently I picked up the diary. You could use the diary. Let it, we have My a cash, cash card at the moment is really quite useless. There can't be more than a dollar or two left in it. Oh, so it's a debit card. Oh, I can look at... I've been keeping a diary intermittently since I was five years old. Not the same one, of course. I started this one, I think, April of this year. Oh, interesting. Hey, it's my timesheet from the cafe. I completely forgot I put it in here. Good thing I found it, because I'm broke. Yes, it's you should. It's my diary. It's my diary. Okay, so it's a list of the hours I worked this past week at the cafe. Um, ah, okay, so oh. we're going to work, okay, right? Okay, do we do we leave the apartment, or do we put clothes on? I think I have to put clothes on. Shelves. <laughs> Ooh, I think intriguing. that's common sense. I'm not good at taking care of living things, but this plant's doing just fine despite months of neglect. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh -oh. oh, that sounds so much like a plant in our house. Alright. Alright, so apparently we have clothes, 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 clothes. Which one? Ooh, toy oh, yeah, monkey. It's Constable Guybrush, my toy mo- Oh, ape. He doesn't much like being called Toy monkey. ape. Tick. Why does it like to be called monkey? It's an inanimate object. Are you really asking? It's a bunch of trees. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't even know why I brought them here. They mean absolutely nothing to me. I could only carry one suitcase with me when I left home. There was so much I would have loved to bring, but... C'est la vie. At least it was a clean break with my past. I guess when all my hard work starts paying off, I'll get a house and fill it you with all kinds clothes. of new junk. The past. Who needs it? Alright, so my wardrobe's sort of chic deficient, but I can't afford to be cutting edge. Useful, practical, and cheap is my shopping mantra. When fame and wealth come knocking, I'll buy a wardrobe the size of an ocean liner and fill it with clothes for a million bucks. When fame and wealth come knocking, I'll buy a when fame and wealth when fame and wealth come when fame and wealth come knocking. I'll buy a wardrobe. Okay. Okay. Apparently, I, think I can't she likes put. To. I can't put clothes on. This is. The I'm wardrobe is actually made of real wood and not that synthetic crap that makes me sneeze and itch all over. So I, I thought maybe like I could put clothes when on. When fame and wealth come knocking, I'll no. buy a wardrobe the size of an no. ocean liner and fill it with only, clothes for a million bucks. I can only look at my clothing, so unfortunately, 
Sorry, everyone. I can't put clothing on. It's kind of unsettling to be I so. I think she needs to put clothing aware on. Aware of myself. Also. But anyways, I'm not the one to judge. Well, I mean, like if I left this room, like it could be problematic. That's my work. It's supposed to be a portrait of my life. Well, I guess it's teacher. like uh, maybe sh maybe this is cl like th these could be pajamas or something. I guess. So, I don't know. Yeah. So we leave the room. It's a picture of me and my friends. Ooh. Let's take it. <laughs> yes, I'm just taking everything. I'm part of the. I don't do that. I just take the relevant stuff. Short generation. Makes sense. Why am I so we good at doing adventure games? <laughs> the last book I read was How to Seduce the Man of Dreams. I think uh, we can go now. Now. If I can just find a man to dream about, I'll be all set. The last book she read was How to Seduce the Man of Your Dreams. I had to borrow some posters from the cafe because I just can't afford to buy any of my own. When I think about we'll it, just go it's now. so depressing. Okay, so we've, we've, this has so far explained to us that she's very, very poor. That's my work. That's it. It's supposed to be a portrait of my life study teacher. But we'll go now. Disagree. We are done with everything. I was waiting for her to finish talking. I'd better head over to the studio to do some work. Only two weeks until the big show opens, and my contribution is in serious need of attention. Might be a good idea to get dressed first, though. Oh. Wait, what? She's a... Now she wants to get dressed. Yeah, oh. exactly. Like, I, like, my first thought was to get dressed. And like then she's like, oh, I should probably get dressed. 